But this isn't a happy birthday. The general is 68 and about to lose everything he's fought for. He makes one last plea for Karen unity. Up to 500 Buddhists have now defected to the slok and they don't hear his birthday speech. This is the veteran guerrilla fighter who gives the orders and has done for more than 25 years. General Bomir, Supreme Military Commander of the Karen Rebel Army, President of the Karen National Union, he's both hero and ageing warlord. He has some 5,000 soldiers left, but the news hasn't been good for years. General La Tu has been fighting alongside Bomia for most of his life. What situation do you like to know? Well, the situation at the front lines. Ah, oh, the front line. Our soldiers stay as before. They're old men now, but 40 years ago they were young guerrillas fighting for Karen independence. They're deeply suspicious of the Burmese because previous ceasefire talks held in Rangoon turned out to be traps for Karen delegates. Why should the world care? First time, he's critical of the Karen National Union. Its leader, Bomia, he says, should accept responsibility for the fall of Manipur. You mend this split. But Bomia and his Christian leaders underestimated the level of disaffection within their own ranks. Among the majority Buddhist soldiers, exhausted by the war and so much...